New at six, concerns of racism at a Wisconsin university. This picture surfaced on social media showing two white students at UW-Whitewater in what some say is blackface. Those students tell stu school officials that wasn't their intention at all. Good evening, I'm Shannon Sims. And I'm Charles Benson. The school's chancellor tells our Yona Gavino it's a teachable moment and the university will address the concerns. This is the photo that's causing controversy on campus. I talked to students who are divided on the message behind it. It does look stupid though, and if they did mean it racially, then that's like 100% wrong. This is the dorm room photo at the center of a heated debate. It went viral after students shared it on Snapchat and Facebook. It appears to show two students in blackface. They indicated that they had no negative intentions, that they, this was a facial, that they did not um, they, they express remorse and not, um, you know, not realizing the, the reaction that there would be to that post. Members of the Black Student Union don't buy that explanation. I think that in this case, they need to have some type of ed educational course. Nicole Rindy doesn't see any harm done and doesn't get the backlash. I think they're taking it a little too far, like... They're just trying to be innocent. The chancellor hasn't discussed disciplinary action towards the students. Instead, she calls the snapshot a teachable moment. Members of the Black Student Union agree a lesson should be learned. So it's important for me to hear that and really understand, and then for us to, again, do more than talk about it, that we really do need to develop an action plan, and we will. And Coppers already started a program called Pizza with a Chancellor. Many shared stories and concerns, but not all students think it's enough. Feeding us isn't going to solve it. Having more pizza parties is not going to solve it. Another Pizza with a Chancellor event will be held next Tuesday, the focus is on campus culture. In Whitewater, Yona Gavino, today's TMJ4.